Oh. The things you do for are you a Winnie. A unicorn? No, no. Yes. There you go. Oh, you're so pretty. You're so pretty. Look at you. It's adorable. You guys just keep putting horns on. Her. I know. <laughs> She's like, bear, please take it off. She's totally forgotten about it. <laughs> How do you do this to the dog? <laughs> vlog so I'm at my parents house today and we are going to see the new Star Wars movie as you can see I'm already got my Star Wars shirt on this is new I got it for myself for Christmas I'm wearing that today and dad is about to take us into the garage because he found two doll houses that he made for my sister and I when we were like seven years old maybe oh, less than that, probably. six five easily four five yeah yeah four or five years old probably. So we are going to be opening these after about 20 years yeah, of been, having them, yeah. which is crazy. And I haven't seen them in that time. So. And they weigh about 40 pounds each. Yeah. And like each, Solid wood. each room's painted a different color, right? Yes. The outside of it's brown and red. Yes. I remember it. And apparently he says that all of our old like Barbie furniture and stuff is still in there. It's probably all mishmashed. Yeah, it's a hurricane. It's a hurricane in there. Hurricane so. Barbie. We're gonna open it for the first time, then we're gonna see what's in there, and we're gonna see which one's Mandy's and which one's mine. Maybe I'll remember. Don't tell me, I wanna guess. I know which one it is. Okay, I wanna I, guess. I know which, which one's, one's Mandy's. Yeah. And I was worried there'd be like spiders living in there, like they made their own home in the dollhouse. Yes? The escape artist is happening. Oh, okay. The escape artist. What's the escape artist? When he got out. Oh. <laughs> Mandy has a client right now, she's doing hair. And we try and like do a barricade there, but she always finds her she way knows. out. She knows. She knows. She's so sneaky. She knows to go back, dude. So anyway, we're heading to the garage to see these. You might need some shoes. Yeah, I'm gonna put on. I'll put on my combat boots. I'm so nervous. That's them. Where? You don't see them? Oh, here? Oh, party, party. <laughs> That's the sign that Ty's mom made. Yeah, see? Brown and red. I remember, and they have little handles that you pull, and they're super heavy. Let's look at them. When you were telling me dollhouses, I was expecting that you guys had maybe like the ultimate Barbie style, like Fisher Price or something. They made them. I know, they're all handmade. That's awesome. That is yeah. ultimate Fisher Price. And mm. we were as tall as them as kids, so it was like magical. And you could hide in them. them if you needed to. Well, I don't know about that. You'll see. They have like floors. So well, I'm thinking it. already at the size that you are right now, you could probably fit in that box. So seven-year-old Jess probably could have definitely hit her way <laughs> probably, in Probably, yeah. I'll just watch you work, Dad. Wow, they're so like thick. That's like it broke. Sorry, Jess. I'm supposed to do that. It has a little lock, so no one would go in and steal our stuff. Mm -hmm. Got to be careful. Got to be really careful. Okay. So that's one. Just the tennis ball floating around. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! This one was mine. Yes. This one was mine. Yes. I remember. Look, there's a shower. And there's some pasta for you. Oh my your gosh, favorite. look. Your favorite. Spaghetti and meatballs. Oh my gosh, this is what we're gonna eat tonight. We're going to an Italian restaurant. We're not gonna eat look, this. You got a, I don't know what that is. That is a sink. Or maybe a bathtub. That's a sink. I think I used it as a bathtub. She just sat this in is your shower, right? And look, there's like a little rug. Oh my gosh. Oh, and like a TV. Set. Oh, this is crazy. And a little, little Coke bottle. And some Mott's Clamato juice. Just Gotta in case. Have Clamato. No, it's apple juice. It's little apple and juice. You know, there's channels on YouTube that like they just get really small things and they're like, and this is a little apple juice. And, and they show so many small items. Have you seen those channels? Right. Oh, my boombox. Is this still open? No, it does not. And we got the granny rocking chair. I used to have like a life cycle for my Barbies, so like they would get old, right? and then you'd put them in a rocking chair and they'd die, and the next life cycle would start. Like their kid would grow up in the, in the house and then That's they would die. a little morbid. This cool little purse. Ooh, goals. This was a Bratz purse. It wasn't a Barbie a purse. 
A knife? <laughs> nope, that was no. for that one life cycle yeah. where Barbie wasn't 100% right. What's in here? Crowns. Oh, this is from Barbie Swan Lake. I'm, oh my god. Something is in god. here, but I don't know what it is. A spider. Is this their first aid kit? Yeah, a spider you comes out. Look, you taped Barbie to the top of oh. this. <laughs> okay, guys, no. This is like the 80s Barbie. Do you know that? I feel so old right now. You got a okay. Food. Here's the rest of your food. I'm going to say, I'd be really concerned if that's where Barbie Please was. <laughs> look, vegetables. And There's a freezer. Did I have the right cream? thing in there? Ice cream? I knew where the ice cream went, okay? At five years old, I put it in the freezer. Another can of Coke. We got a, oh, I put that, that's not supposed to be there. Five-year-old Jess knew better than you do. <laughs> Got a little lettuce. And uh, I don't know what that is, dog food? Barbie dog food. In the fridge? Yeah. Good. You know, it's been yeah. in there for 20 years, so. But it's canned good, so it might have lasted. This was a My Scene. Do you guys remember My Scene dolls? Jam it in Jamaica. That was a movie I used to love. There's your stereo. Stereo. Yeah, this is all messed up. Look, there's a dishwasher with the plate. Old school cell phone. Yeah. The giant cell phones back then. We've got a couch. We're gonna find a spider in here. Like, it's gonna happen. Uh, I don't think you will. And the funny thing was, the floor height was just, it would touch their head. So if they were walking through, they'd like hit the ceiling constantly. So basically my life. Winnie. There's Winnie. This is like early 90s Barbie doll, or bar Barbie pet. Did you see the Barbie on the TV? She's like reporting, today at the beach, three dolphins. Computer? Spat on people. The first apple? This is like, Mac. what's that style that people like? Retro. No. For We're, what? What What are you talking you know about? that style that people wear now that's really popular? Retro? Television style? No, like where they have all like the tech stuff and like... Synthwave. <laughs> Kind of like that, yeah. This Not really. You can find shirts with stuff like that on it. I like to. You love lamp, Jess. I love lamp. And these had attics, eh? They did. And I used to have like a little ghost in the attic. In like. Was it just the one Barbie that passed away that you just put a sheet on? <laughs> I just stuffed them in the attic after they died. <laughs> that's Jess, that's a rookie move. You put them in the basement. That's really terrible. Anyway, so this was my house. Oh my gosh, guys. Look how 90s the style is here. Wasn't that like every single fast food chain had like that? On the cups. Yeah, on the yeah. cups. You have to see Manny. Does Manny's have as much as I have mine? Oh, oh yeah. Really? Yeah. This is so special. It's definitely interesting. And then when we have kids, they're gonna have to play with 80s Barbie toys. It's gonna be great. Because we're cheap? No, because it's nostalgic. Well, the dollhouse, absolutely. That's awesome. Got to see what's in Mandy's. Mine's way cooler. Was Mandy's like super hardcore? Everything was hot pink and black on the Everything inside. Everything studs on it. <laughs> Mandy had the party house. I had the nice, delicate house. Da -da -da -da. Mandy's abode. I'm liking the yellow room. We had similar things. There's a crib. Her Barbies had children. A mixer. That works. A mixer. Does it work? I think it's the other way. Even fake mixers are hard to use. Oh, I remember this used to turn on. We should get batteries, Dad. Come on. Change batteries when light dims. Yeah, the lights can dim. Look, 1999. Look at. <gasps> Guys! <laughs> the Mary Kate and Ashley TV. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, and the ducky bathtub. I used to fill this up with water and you would squeeze the duck and it would like shoot out water at the little kid. I don't know why. Got the vanity. Vanity looking out onto the beach. Really uh, fancy. I don't know what that is. Open Maybe some nail polish. Maybe. I don't know. I love how they had like the boards behind everything just in case you didn't have actual Barbie clothes. They're like, don't worry, we faked it anyway. <laughs> I think my house was cooler. A, These oh, Barbies were definitely leaving in style, rushing. apparently. I wouldn't do that. <laughs> I know, it's probably covered in like... <laughs> probably know. covered in the same stuff those teddy bears were. Crazy! Oh, oh look. Spatula. Wonder bread. They actually had real brands on things. Coke. There's some more food. Oh, man, you said you spin it and it changes to a different food. And I also knocked down a decent amount of luggage over here. So those were our old Barbie houses that I cannot believe still has furniture in it. I thought we got rid of everything in our old garage sales, but apparently we didn't. No, this is something nice to keep. Yeah, I love it. Well, our cousins are here, so we are heading to the Italian restaurant. We will see you there. Ow, I just cracked my thumb trying to hit the record button off. 
Dozer has worked his way in. He's excited. Hi, Dozer. We got the boys here. Hi. We're going to Star Wars. Yeah, we are. I said that like three times. Well, first we're going to a restaurant, but we're just pretty much getting ready and then we're heading out. No, it's so. funny because Cam arrived and he's like, so where are we going? He doesn't even know. He just trusts us. I understand that food Cam, is Cam, we're going on an adventure. I will we're going on an adventure. Hey, see, you yeah. think that's a good thing. It could be a bad thing. So where are we actually going? Okay, we're going to the Italian place. What's it called? What's it called? <gasps> They'll know where we live. Boston Pizza? La Donna yeah, the Italian Mangela place. place. Yeah. Oh, Eastside Marius? No. Italian people are gonna hate you saying that. I don't think I don't think I'm dressed up enough for Eastside Marius. You look like a tomato. Is that green underneath? Listen, I want to clarify. I'm a reverse <laughs> Eastside Marius, Marius is not supposed to be an Italian place. It's supposed to be New York. Oh, is it? Ita yeah, I did the stuff. But I'm pretty York sure Italian. most people in New York are mad if we say that Eastside Marius is a New York restaurant. <laughs> so what does hey bada boom mean? Okay, yeah, we're going to an Italian restaurant. Yes. Nice. And then we're going to Star Wars. Yep. Done. So we just ordered our food. I got my usual, which is penne alfredo with shrimp and a Caesar salad to start. There you go. Luke can Luke. try and pronounce it. What'd you get? No, let's not do this again. I got spaghetti a la flip. I got spaghetti and meat sauce. He took the easy way out. Spaghetti, spaghetti bala meat sauce. Good enough. Mandy. Mandy, after you're done cringing. <laughs> I love you. Listen to the pronunciation. It's not that special. Caesar salad to start. And then I got penne. I got a Caesar too. And I'm drinking that Italian. Monte Pulciano de Bruzzo. Oh. Yes, yeah. I am getting chicken parmesan and I'm starting with the vegetable soup. Caesar salad to start. And the best gnocchi in the entire planet. Um, I didn't get anything to start because I didn't know that was an option. <laughs> And I got polo o parmigiana with a bed of penne alfredo. I love how you're you shaking your glass like it's wine. <laughs> it's just water, buddy. He's like And what did you get? I have no idea. Oh, he got the cheese wheel. I, I didn't just get a wheel of cheese. But if I did, that was an option. <laughs> you did, you did no, just did. ask for the wheel. Do they have a cob salad? A <laughs> cob salad. If I got a cheese wheel, my uh, bill would be very expensive. <laughs> what kind of cheese? But I no, also got your wine. I'm su supposedly it is a pasta that is tossed on the top of a cheese wheel so it melts the cheese nice oh, into it with yeah, exactly. tomato sauce on top of it. I don't know the proper pronunciation so I'm not gonna butcher it but that's what I'm getting. Very good. We'll show you when it comes here. I don't think it's a smiley face. It's more of a don't eat me face. A little bit. It was a smiley face. Okay, now it's gone. We're actually recording the food this time. Jesse, you have your that? My that? Your that? This is my that. It's your that? It's really Luke awesome. has his that. This is my spaghetti a la meat sauce. Mandy, you have yours? A la vodka. Mama V. My bush. A la gnocchi. You got my heart? Your meat heart. Oh! <laughs> Hi, Doveen. Hi, Doveen. Hi, Doveen. Hi, shake your bum. Shake your bum, yeah, shake your bum. Okay, so we just got back from Star Wars, so we got to talk about what we think about it. I personally loved it. Favorite movie of their new movies? Favorite one? Out of seven, eight, nine. Out of seven, eight, nine. Yeah. Favorite one. And Dad agrees. Completely agree. It was so good. Yeah, it was very good. And it was like an emotional roller coaster because like you think someone's gonna die and they don't. I'm not gonna like you know if spoil you it for you. It. No spoiler. But it was so good. Like I cried like eight times because they bring a lot of like the old nostalgic Star Wars back. I'm not gonna tell you how, but like I don't know if you grew up watching the older movies, they bring a lot of stuff back. That's just really emotional. So uh, yeah, it was good. What did I think? Out of the new three. I would probably say that this one was my favorite because the first one of the new three was just episode four. So this one, I liked it. I know people might be like, ah, or whatever. Everyone's entitled to their own opinion. Flashy effects. I'm easily distracted. I enjoyed it. And mom? So I definitely think that there were some really good moments. I really loved the scene between and I thought that was very emotional and very gripping. I loved the scene with the waves and the fighting on the ship on the old ship i thought that was really epic and i just find that with star wars 
it just gets a little cheesy sometimes and a little predictable. You know, there everybody's dying till the very end and then everybody shows up to help. And that's a typical thing we see throughout Star Wars. And then the, you know, the Sith, you know, with his hand creating power and uh, it's just done. <laughs> that is Star Wars. <laughs> that is Star Wars. Like, hey. <laughs> it's just it's just it's so like it's so cheesy. I'm so no, over it. No, it's so good. I'm so over it. I just wish they'd come up with something new. You weren't they emotional? Will. It didn't was, make you emotional? I was emotional a few times. I do love Star Wars. I do, so don't hate me. I've watched them out of, all. Out of, the, I, out of seven, eight, nine. Which was one, this your favorite? Which one out of seven, eight, nine? Oh, definitely. Yeah. It closed a lot of loose ends. Oh, it's not sure. closed. It's not done. It's just begun. They've been it's saying... It's just begun. This has <laughs> been 50 years, I've been it's hearing, just begun. I've been hearing that this, oh, this is the last one. This is the last episode. one. It's never the last one. So they're going to have side stories. Yeah. It's, ne it's never the last. It's just going to live forever. They make too much money. They're going to have side stories. Oh, sorry. It story. might be the last of, like, this order of movies it'll be just on disney plus it'll all be on disney plus well they'll make tv shows that's why they got disney plus probably for star wars and it occurred to me it's a very spiritual star wars yeah i mean in so many ways like, good overcomes evil yeah, right yes. and i like that that's what staying away from that. temptations mm -hmm. you know like fighting your inner demons yep and when in uh, doubt, shoot lightning at things yeah exactly yeah. whenever in doubt shoot lightning yeah that's right and can we just talk about the person sitting in front of me? Did you see this, Dad? I always have the best luck in, in the world. Now? So I was sitting. So we're in D box, which is when you sit on these comfy chairs that move around while but you watch didn't the movie. Move at all, so no, mine did move. I had it on the same level as everybody else. And like as you're watching things and they're fighting, like your chairs like moving around like this, and like it's really interesting to like watch a movie that way. So the person sitting right in front of me, you know how like you can recline your chair, yeah. and like usually. If you're a normal human being who's respectful and cares about other people, you push it back a little bit if you want to chill. This person in front of me, like, you know how a car seat can, like, go all the way back? I don't even know how they watch the it's movie. They must have been watching it like this. Because they were all the way back, lying on my legs as if I knew them. And, like, my chair is moving like this, and my legs are doing this. <laughs> so, like, my knees are squeezing in between this person constantly the whole movie. Well, and this person will get excited. He's having his own D-Box experience. He's just sitting there doing this. So he didn't have a moving chair, okay? Because like you have to oh, pay for a certain yeah. row to have moving chairs. So the people in front of us didn't have moving <laughs> chairs. They had regular seats. And he was so into oh, the movie his chair was moving. that like anything that was happening, he would like sit this way and then slam back. And every time he slammed back, it would hit my knees. Oh. And I'm a short person. So for him Are to get okay? all the way back there, I'm not okay. I probably have bruises. And I was gonna say something, but honestly, Brampton is so sketchy that you don't know what they're gonna do after the movie. They can follow you to your car, yeah, I know. It's, do something it's like not worth it. It was this man, a full grown man. I'm not gonna like yell at him. Who knows what they're gonna do afterwards? Like, this world is too scary to like confront people. Yeah, if it was some girl my age, I'd be like, yo, he was a stop. Sin. Even a girl, are you he kidding? He was definitely a sin. Doesn't matter. Whoever. Yeah, he's no, on the dark I, side. He's on, he's on the dark side? Maybe he was mad that the want good people want won at the end. I don't know. But I'm glad you didn't do anything. I'm glad you stuck well, to I it. Because Ty stuck his foot. I stuck my foot in the gap of his chair so he couldn't go back far enough. And he kept trying. <laughs> and he's probably like, why isn't this going back anymore? <laughs> Ty's poor foot. The last half an hour of the movie. Why you were so calm? Because I'm thinking, Ty's gonna flip out on this dude. I jammed my foot in his chair. No, he almost did. He was getting really close, and I'm like, Ty, don't do it. Brampton's sketchy. So he stuffed his foot in between, like, the floor and the chair. So every time the guy went back, he'd stop. Make a compromise, unfortunately. You don't want him getting your legs smacked, and he probably doesn't want to cause a scene, so foot in the chair. Yeah. So there. I just so slightly and slowly started working my way. If I saw he was getting a little too close, I just push it a little further in front. So there you go, <laughs> dude. Your D-Box experience, ruined. He made his own D-Box experience. No. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you've seen the Star Wars movie, comment down below what you think without giving away any spoilers because some people have not seen it yet. It's only been out for like a week now, so be nice. But like maybe give it a rating or like if it's your favorite one or which one's your favorite one. And uh, yeah, have a good rest of your day and we'll see you in the next vlog. Bye. 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 See ya. May the force be with you. <laughs>